Sheldon friends, should we boost some more charities helping people right now? I think we should. So let's do it. The Rossing Center for Education and Dialogue. This is a Jerusalem-based organization working towards understanding justice and equality. They have a diverse Israeli-Palestinian staff composed of Jews, Christians, and Muslims. Right now, their volunteers, including the person who sent this to me, are supporting Palestinian residents of East Jerusalem, where families have been severely impacted by the war. Like so many communities who need help right now, people are afraid to leave their neighborhoods or travel for work and the supply chains have been disrupted, so living conditions have deteriorated. This group set up an emergency appeal and is organizing food supplies and other essential items and distributing them through local community centers in various neighborhoods in East Jerusalem. Next, I would like to boost Barzillai Medical Center. This is a frontline hospital. It is under fire, it has been hit by rockets, but it is still treating mass casualties. The hospital is creating underground areas where newborns and critical patients are relocated for protection and treatment. Next up is Natal. This is an apolitical organization providing treatment and support to direct and indirect victims of trauma due to terror and war. Natal services are available to all citizens, regardless of religion, ethnic background, age, gender, or socioeconomic status. Natal's hotlines are currently inundated with calls from people trying to cope in this nightmare. Next, I want to boost a fundraiser for the unrecognized Arab villages in the Negev. This is a volunteer-led fundraiser. It's a GoFundMe to support the over 40 Bedouin villages of the Negev um, with hundreds of thousands of residents. These villages are not currently recognized by the government and thus are not protected uh, by the Iron Dome. They do not have warning sirens and lack safe rooms or bomb shelters. There is an immediate need for food, water, first aid, and emergency housing for this community. So with the money they're raising on this GoFundMe, they are using those funds to purchase supplies as well as transport donated food, donated goods that they need to these villages. As always, check my link in bio for these and the other charities I've spoken about and some I haven't spoken about on the videos yet, but any support is welcome. I just recommend doing some research to understand the charity itself, even the ones on this list. Feel free, please do. Do your own research so you know how your dollars will be used and that it's aligned with what you think is important. So thank you again to everybody who has donated. Thank you again to everybody who is working at these organizations and who is volunteering at these organizations and who is sharing these links and trying to get everybody as much support as we possibly can. Thank you.